Okay, hello everyone, and welcome back to the journey from Space World. And today, well, we're just going to continue doing what we did last Sunday, which, by the way, Happy Mother's Day on this hectic day for some of us. All right. So last time we got this set up, and I managed to get most of my stuff sorted <laughs> it is a little glitchy though I don't know. like the renderings I don't know. but anyway we are working over here today so I had to make some more storage and I also decided to make some more uh, furnaces and pulverizers to do the ores because honestly I'm putting a lot through whenever I'm taking out these uh, meteors that hit so much so in fact I probably really don't need a mine even though I am going to make one eventually but this here is nice it just don't um, do it quick enough I mean oh and there goes that loud humming again I mean, I still have some stuff here that needs processed through here. Let's see. I got some more of those. That's good. Need that. Grab those. Alright. Oh, wait. Better grab the glass, too. I guess I might need some of that, too. But, uh, yeah. So, I still need to figure out how I'm going to power. Oh, you are loud. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna power this thing because this many, uh, machines, that little power I have over there ain't gonna work. That's just the long and short of it. Alright, let's throw those in here for now. Grab that back out. And... I definitely know I am going to need more of those. Alright, but first, I want to double check because I set up the thing here. Alright, uh, oh, I need those. <laughs> Don't know why they were over there. And where's that? Sun. I've been trying to be extra careful not to die. <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay. Uh, that one. The other nice thing. Yes, it's nice to fly, but also nice to get under here. Okay, so I set this up to sort out the stuff here that needs to come over. So now once I get this done, I'll, I already put a servo on here. So I'll be able to just turn that on and let it pump out over here. So let's see, do I have, of course not, why would I have dirt? All right, let's go in here, get some dirt, all right. And for now at least we'll just cover that up. All right. Now, come back down, go back in normal. Alright. So, let's see. Yeah. Did I have one left from the other? Okay. So, basically, what I want to do is fill in this for my floor. Because this is going to be where I'm setting up the machines. And it's just going to be a basic square because it's a lot easier to work with it than any odd angles and whatnot. And I have made some more Java barrels because, uh, honestly, what I have over there, and there's, what, uh, 18, wait, I don't know, I forget how many is over there. I think there's... 36 maybe um, but it's not enough so I had to make some more and then 
I made them other things. So, I've been working a little bit on it, not a whole lot on here. Um, yeah. Because I was also doing uh, my other series, which I was working a good bit on. Um, the You Pick It mod series because I changed some of the things on there, so oh, I'll get it though. Yeah. But yeah, that's the basic plan today though. Is to get this done and figure out how I'm setting things up because right now oh alright, so I'm gonna have to Tell you what, this takes a, a lot of nether brick, but I like this brick, so I think it looks pretty cool. So it's definitely going to be my floor, and it's not like I don't have enough nether rack considering a good bit of these meteors is made out of it. Alright, now once that pumps out, it'll come up here, and let's see. I need my pulverizers. Alright. Uh, for now, we'll stick you there like this, I guess. Uh, oh. No! No, 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 no. Um, oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to move those. Uh, what did I do wrong? back. Ah, oh, come on. And what? Uh, yeah, that one's even less, uh, or takes longer, but it work better. Oh, well. Uh, break these up here. And, right. Okay, so let's try this again. still gonna be one off. I mean, I'm not a whole big on s s uh, keeping things symmetrical, but I do like whenever they're somewhat even. Uh, oh well, I'll make another one. It'll fix it. Alright, so I went and it would appear that my attempts to not die were in vain as <laughs> I paused the video and I forgot to pause the uh, game by hitting the escape button to bring up the game menu so yeah something killed me I don't even know what killed me how I died whatever I don't know I guess I'll uh, ah Oh, ooh, somebody's in my house. No. Why are you in my house? Why is that door open? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I am lagging hardcore. Uh, okay, this ain't good. Um, let's see. Get over here. Here, only you know if I have it or not in here. Uh, let's see. I do got a bow. That's good. And I got some arrows. That's good. Uh, let's see. A oh, man, am I lagging? I don't know why I'm lagging so bad. Right. I have another bow up there. And yeah. That ain't gonna help me. 
Okay, so looks like I'm gonna have to use this. So where'd that bugger go? Ah. Whew. Well, at least he was almost dead. Ah, guess we'll put that on. Alright, now need to go back out. Why does it say Okay, I heard the man in my wagon. May have to restart. I don't know. Okay. Why did it say I died over here? I wasn't even over here. I was over there. How did I die over here? Um, what's it say I died from? I was killed by a zombie. Nice. And I can't get my stuff, so I gotta do it that way. Alright. Let's see, did I get everything back? Got my weapon, got my food, got that. Um, Alright, so what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was going to uh, say, before I had to go deal with real life issues, I keep hearing something, I don't know. But anyway, uh, I might have an issue here with something, um, yeah, hold on, go in the back form here, and I'm sorry if you hear that mowing outside, but they decided that they had to mow right now, so, alright, um, now, unless I put a servo, and I'm lagging again, unless I put a servo in every one of those things over there, I am going to have an issue because I don't think this can be pulverized. Now, I know in uh, the Tinker's Construct Aluminum it can be pulverized. I don't think this one can. Um, oh, yeah, I forgot I ain't got no power yet. <laughs> Alright, let's go over here. Just want to test it real quick because I may have to prevent it from getting put in. Alright, let's see. Can it be pulverized? No, it can't. That's what I thought. Alright. Um, yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, so I'm going to have to stop. Oh, you're hiding in my house, or in my supply yard, though. Get out of there. Alright. Um, yeah. Gonna have to change this. Oh, no, that ain't it. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. Alright, I'm gonna need to now... be underneath um, yeah it's this one here I need to take that one off of there because I don't want it to go in there now because that will mess things up if it does because it can't be pulverized so let's see which one's the in um, this one Alright, so now when I put it in there, it should wind up back over in here. Which will be where it should be because I can't have it come in, in here unless I put a servo in every single one of these to prevent it from uh, going into them. So, I don't know though because these pipes usually, you know what, it may actually work. I don't know, I'm going to have to do some more testing. But, them pipes usually are smart enough if the item can't go into the machine, it usually won't put it in, I don't think. Uh, find out here. Grab a furnace. And we will grab... Where, oh, there they are. Okay, so we grab a furnace. Just shove it there for now. And we will put this piping here for now alright so 
so let's see, come back in here. Um, did it come through yet? No. Did it go back down bottom? Or maybe it's just that slow going through, I don't know. Uh, come back down. Um, no, it didn't come back down here. But I want to see. I'm going to get back up here. Uh, well, this is all part of the process. Where the heck did you go? Did you get put in a... No, you couldn't have because I had you all... You must just be... T ah, there you are. You were just taking your good old time getting over there, apparently. Alright, throw that in there, throw that in there, throw that in there. Good. Okay. So, what I want to see is if... Oh, you know what? Dang it. I looked right at it before, and I forgot to grab it. Uh, I need my wrench. And this is why a scout thing got in my house, because I left my door open again. Alright, where's that wrench? There it is. Alright, um... Double check to make sure. Nope, see? This is why skeletons get in, because I leave doors open. Alright, close those. Now... Come back over here. Get back down here. Alright. Now, open this. The rest of these, I'm pretty sure, can go right to the thing. But let's see what happens when I do that. Now, I could blacklist it right here. So that way it don't even get put. But, oh. Uh, Let's see what happens. Hopefully something happens. Yeah, okay, they're out of there. Uh, huh. And oh wait, these ain't got power, that's right. Ah, bugger, 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 bugger. Hmm. So what did it do with that stuff then? Well, the aluminum went to the furnace. That's good. Copper went here. Okay, copper went there. Okay. So the items went into the different things. So that's good. Yeah, all right. I don't know why. Okay. And it seems like it went over here just fine. So... That may not be an issue, except, uh, I really did, well, you know what I could do is put a servo here and just whitelist that, so that way only the aluminum goes over there. Oh, and I need an empty hand. Uh, yeah, could do that. I'll just set that like that. And then I'll have to get a servo, which, uh, do I put them in here or are they still over in the other place waiting to be moved? Or don't I have any? I may have used them all, actually. Are you tell me I didn't sort out rotten flesh? Yeah, apparently I didn't. This is why I said I definitely don't have enough storage area. Oh, and the sun's going down, which isn't good. Alright, so, land, go back into normal mode, make sure my doors are shut, they are, alright, uh, yeah, okay, cool, let me sleep, yay, alright, now I got to see if I can find a servo, I don't even know if I have one over here, <laughs> I should. I don't think I used them all. Nah, there it is. I don't know why I didn't bring it with me to start with. Idiotic, I guess. Um, yeah. And I went out the wrong door. Oh. Oh, well. Guess we're going to walk around a little bit here. 
guess while I'm walking around I'll check and see if I close these other doors I think this is the one I left open nope closed it okay good alright now we'll come back over here and we'll put this in here for now so that way I can whitelist that that way the only thing that goes in there is the aluminum because I don't want any of these other ones to go in or else I'll lose you know production availability because honestly you know you get two by pulverizing and you only get come on that ain't even a too high square get out of oh, are you kidding me you should be able to get right up out of there. Oh well, whatever. I don't know why you ain't working. Oh come on. Nothing wants to cooperate today. Alright, get up here. Put that back. Alright. Now you Ooh, how'd you get in there? Whenever you're not whitelisted for in there. Well wait, no. That's right. No, can this be pul No, this can be pulverized, right? Yeah, so it should not have one in there. Ugh. Okay, so now you're not even coming out at all? What the heck? I have you whitelisted. Why are you not working? Ugh. Oh, there's two tents stuck in the pipe, that's why. Alright, so let's say that got pulverized. So now the tin should come in here. Maybe. so much easier if I had power than I could test this stuff. Should have tested it before I recorded. Okay, so that went through. And I don't know where... Okay, there's the tin that was stuck. And... Let's see. Guess give it a couple minutes because this thing's slow. Yeah, there it is. Alright, now... That other one should not go in there. It should go in... Well, actually, it should have went in here because I had to open. Yeah, it did. Okay. Good. All right, so that'll work. And then what I'll do is I'll set up furnaces over here on a separate thing because I don't want it uh, doing all the dust at once because I may need to mix it together or something, so... Though I could you make an, well I do have an alloy, uh, what's that thing, that smelter thing over there. So I could use it I guess. Oh, but this is the basics of how this will work. What I could do actually is, first off, go back in the normal. Because, instead of putting the extra pulverizer here. I can just go like this and put that oops wrong spot put that no wait a minute where did I have that extra spot at down here yeah here it is all right so we'll put it there like that and then we'll take that take that and we'll come down here Run that there, and then we're gonna put that back on there. And I want to whitelist this again. Alright, so I whitelist that. So now stuff should come in here to be pulverized, and if it's aluminum, it'll come down here for this. So that should work. Alright. 
Now, all I need is to put some outpipes on top, which I'm going to need more servos for. Or, no, wait. Do these pump out automatically, or do I have to servo pump them? Oh, I can't remember. But anyway, I need more servos. I need more uh, power conduit thingy. Now, let's see. Close that. Um, yeah, because all I have is this leadstone. That definitely is not going to be enough. Actually, even at this, I don't think that's going to be outputting enough energy either. Uh, energy, let's see. Uh, do, do, do. Where is it? Okay, so, harden. Here's what I want. Um, yeah, you need three of those, redstone and invar, which I have all that, so, I'm thinking I may actually want to go up to that, that way it's 400 RF a tick. Because each of those machines over here use quite a bit. You know, uh, let's see. The furnace uses, what's it use? 20. And yeah, and these use 40. So if I'm only pumping out 80, that's definitely not going to be enough. Because right here alone, I'd have enough for a 400 power one to just barely be able to manage it so yeah I'm definitely gonna have to make um, better energy conduits so I definitely need to do that and I need uh, what do I oh I need to figure out how I want to even yeah, that's right, because all I have is that leadstone energy cell over there. I'm going to need to probably upgrade to a harden, which ain't hard. I can still the leadstone and put an invar around it. But I'd rather not steal that one. Probably just have to make a new one. I should have enough stuff. If not, I'll go around and mine out some of these meteors. Because that's definitely... A very good place to get ore. <laughs> they may be a pain in the butt, but they are a good place to get ore, that's for sure. And jump up here and get rid of that level before I end up dying again. Alright, um, uh, let's see, what am I even looking for? I don't know. Well, I went brain dead. Oh, yeah, I know. I need to see. Either I need to make a different generator. Oh, what am I lagging on you? There we go. Gener did I spell it right? Yeah, okay. Okay, so right now I have this. Which is fine for that little thing. That one's pathetic. I could go to this one, but then I'd have to get lava, which I could do. I mean, that ain't too hard or I could try one of these other generators but I really don't want to upgrade to them yet because uh, now this one here I could probably upgrade to because of the fact it's pretty much the same thing but I don't want to change over to EU though because I'm using RF and MJ right now now, I could do this one, but I don't have biofuel stuff, so... What's this one require? Gold, a block of iron, a furnace, and redstone. I might try one of those. Just... Because... I don't know. I just have a feeling that little generator I have just isn't gonna cut it. And not quite nighttime yet getting there not quite but uh yeah oh man's that thing loud 
but yeah, I have this one over here. I just, I don't know, I don't think that's going to cut it though. Alright, let's go over here, go to bed, and make sure nothing's going to creep up and kill me, hopefully. Alright, so I need, what do I need? I need to go this way. Uh, come over here. Still need to get a door on here. <laughs> All right. Um. Let's see. Gold. Yeah, I need my gold. Gonna need to get more gold apparently. All right. I need gold and I need iron, right? Yeah. Cause I need an iron block and I need redstone. Right, so, I need a block of iron, like so, and then it was gold here, and, oh, I need a furnace, dang it, no, it's going to forget something, alright, uh, cobblestone, here, okay, so, I need, oh, why did they give me two stuff, ah, oh. I don't know. What? Since I started up again, I've been having a lot of lag. I may need to restart or something. Alright, so one lava generator. There we go. And now we'll come back here. Just chuck that stuff back in there for now. Chuck those in there for now. Alright. And we'll just set this here till I see... Okay, so it takes lava, but don't tell me what the production rate is, I guess. And I can't pick it up that way. Okay, so give me this. And give me that back. Alright, and I don't think I have any lava. Do I have buckets? And that's a crafting table that ain't gonna have any buckets in it <laughs> oh boy yeah try to be unique with my build but I'll tell you what this building is annoying dispensers droppers uh, I did have a furnace dang it oh well oh well I'm sure I'll need another generator anyway No buckets, no lava, oh wait, buckets right there, duh, wow, I need help, I do, alright, let's take a quick look and see if we can find some lava real quick, if not, I'll have to do it the other way and go hunt for it in one of my many caverns underneath, there's firestone there, which I would like to use at some point in a boiler, but man, getting that Firestone processed is a pain. Uh, oh, wait, I know where there's lava. Haha, <laughs> just thought about it. There's lava from where that meteor hit over here. That made this another portal. That's right. Okay, so we're going to go over there and get us some lava now. We'll see what kind of power output this generator has. Because I don't even know. I've never used one. But yeah, there we go. Woohoo! Easy access to lava. Likes it. Might be annoying, but I likes it. Okay, so we got that. And good thing I didn't come over here and just clean it up how I usually do, which is throwing a block on it. <laughs> I didn't get around that, so that's cool. I got three buckets of lava, and I think that's it. I think the rest of this is all flowing. I don't think there's any more source. Nope. I think that's it, unless there's one on the other side here. Uh, nope. That'd be it. Alright. Oh, well. 
It is all flowing, right? Yeah, I think. Oh well, three buckets is good enough to test it with, though. I'll get more. Ain't no biggie. After all, I do have two portals to the nether if I have to. <laughs> uh, I just wanted something real quick to test it out. Yeah. So. But. Yeah, now you get another aerial view of the mess. I haven't really got a whole lot cleaned up. I did clean up some closer to the base, but like in this area, I've cleaned out some because I've been clearing it out, processing it, and whatnot. So, all right, back into normal and eat real quick here. Right. So let's see. We'll just set this here. Grab one of these. So that way we can see what the, uh... Alright, so... Ah, oh, that stinks. It has the same power output. Well, one nice thing is, though, it don't use all love at once, I guess. And it seems to be... Well, hold on, let's get rid of any eye here. And it seems to be coming up with some good power, I guess. Uh... Apparently uses 200 millibuckets for ten, what eight ten seconds? Ten seconds. So that'll work, but as I was saying over here, I think this one has the same power output, and it uh, lasts for like 20 seconds or something with cold coke. Oh, let's see. Uh, this one. Grab a piece of cold coke here. Which I'm getting some of. But, yeah, see, 80 power for 30 seconds. So, honestly, running that lava generator, while efficient in a way, it, so I'll put in that is probably less than this one so really I'm probably better off going with just another one of those but I already have this one built so I'll just use it that's fine it's just I don't know honestly I don't think it's all that much of an improvement overall well maybe I don't know uh, I hate that you know I'm gonna waste that power I put in there but it was only a test, so, oh well. Pop that out. Alright. So we'll put, oh no, it retained the power. That's cool. Yay! I thought I would have lost it. Alright, put that in there for now. Put that there, put that there. Alright. So, now I need to upgrade my energy conduits, which I should have grabbed out of here when I was over here which I did grab them and I like an idiot put them back in there I don't know why ah <sighs> stupid me alright so come over here I need um what are you you're furious I don't need you in the bar that's what I need oh wait do I need I think I need glowstone too Pretty sure that it goes like that, like that, and then like that. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. Alright, so put those there, put those there, and put like that. Alright, so now we got nine hardened, which will pump out 400, which is good. Alright. Ah. Unfortunately, I gotta bust up my floor. Ah. This. I should have thought of that. But I didn't. Of course not. Why would I? That would require me thinking ahead. Something I never do. Alright. 
So I need to put energy here, like so. And of course I don't have enough. Why would I? All right, let's put that back here for now. So that we can't see my energy cable. I need to make some more. Oh, wait. Okay, that was nine energy. That means I have 11 things. Oh, you know what? Uh, 400 coming through there probably ain't gonna be enough then. Because that's gonna require, what, 420? Yeah. It's gonna require 420 with that on there. To keep them all powered efficiently, I mean. But then again, I won't be running that all the time, I guess. So that'll work. Oh well. Uh, go back in here and go back to bed before I die again. Still like not how I died over by the pumpkin patch. Whenever I don't remember being over at the pumpkin patch. <laughs> so I don't know how I got over there and died. Uh, but anyway, sleep here. Alright. So that is pretty much what I need to do. Okay, so I think I'm going to pause here, and this is going to be a longer video probably. But I think I'm going to pause here, make the uh, servos I need, make the, uh, what else do I need? I need energy conduits, and I need to set all that up. Oh, what fun. But yeah, I think I will pause it here so that way you're not watching me walk, run around like an idiot, which I do quite a bit of. And, uh, yeah, I'll come back once I get that all done, I guess. So, all right. Well, we shall see you in a minute. Well, a minute for you. Don't know how long it'll take me, but either way, I'll be back. Okay. All right, I'm back after a full restart. And, yeah, still seem to have a little bit of lag. I don't know. But anyway, need to wrap this up pretty soon because it's actually over the time I usually have allotted for recording. So, but I wanted to show you what was done over here. So we'll go over here real quick or as quick, quickly as I can walk, I guess. Yeah, so uh, since the thing crashed, I reviewed the video, and honestly, I have no idea how I got over here whenever I ended off pausing over here. So I am not sure how my character got from here to there, but I don't know, that's a mystery. One I guess I won't figure out, but anyway, this is what I did. I ran two separate power things because I knew this would not be enough power so I ran the one power that you can see here and I connected off these two to this uh, hardened energy cell then I made another hardened energy cell over here and I ran uh, where is it? there it is I uh, tossed away some stuff that I didn't need but yeah see under here I ran I'm not gonna dig it all back up but uh, are you serious? Come on. Dang it. Okay. Bat form. Fly back up out of here. Alright. So basically what I did was the same thing I did over there. I ran the power under here and connected it here to these redstone furnaces. Now what I'm going to do is anything that, any ores and that that I uh, grind up over here. I'll have to manually, for now, pick up, put in here, and let it go through. But that's still better than what I had over there. Now, I still have that set up over there for now, but... Yeah, this is going to eventually be my new setup. Now, when I hooked up the thing... The, uh... These things got power. Over here, so... We will grab these out real quick. And let's 
see that to go there. Grab that out. Grab that out. Yeah, I haven't set it up to empty these yet, so I'll grab that out. Alright. Um that's that and then got that. Now you don't get experience from the processor, so or the pulverizer, sorry, not processor, from the pulverizer. So that won't matter. I can have that automatically output. Now these ones should, in theory at least, oops, that don't go in there. Uh, throw those in there like so. And that should work its way around. Why are you not, oh, that's right. I set it up, but I forgot to put in the... <laughs> Cool Coke. Oh, yay. What a genius. Like I said, I've been having issues. Alright, now this is set up to... Yeah, I'll put out the bottom. And I want it set to output at 350 and input at 400. Alright, so now you're inputting. And we'll... Well, actually, I'm going to have to output at 400 too, huh? Because these take... What? 40? No, 20. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. Oh, good. I can knock that down then. I, I'll knock it down 300. And that means I should still be able to run at full power, which right now they're not because they're still building up because I forgot to put the cold coke in. But it's in there now. But like I said, this runs at 80 for 30 seconds. This one over here runs at 80. Oops. Uh, there we go. This one over here runs at 80 for like 10 seconds. But I'm not sure with the lava because how it... Ah, people blowing their horns going by. Um... Not sure how it compares to the cold coke, so we'll have to see. But for now, that'll work at least. And what is being pulverized? Osmian, apparently. Okay. Uh, now I do have this outputting, right? Yeah, I have it outputting at 400 and input at 400 because these things require 40, and there's 10 of them, so they're definitely going to require all 400 power going through the line so and ooh, got that one and we'll check these yeah okay and so now I have that set up where I can just put that in there like so yeah. all right there we go I don't know why I keep getting these lag spikes these Rarely do I get them on other packs, but ever since I added that meteor shield, I've been getting some major lagging issues. Alright, so that'll put that through. Uh, take out that dust. Shiny metal I'll keep because I need that for other stuff. Which is the also why I don't want it all directly cooking out. Because you never know when you need it again. So, yeah. Okay, so we'll take that out there. Take that out. Apparently, Osmin don't give you... Okay. I don't know why I just got that achievement again. Uh, I've been having issues with achievements on here. Don't know. Anyway. Take these out of here. That one's empty and that one's empty. All right. So, I still need to set up some more storage things over here because I'll need to be able to store dust that needs stored. And I'm going to need to be able to uh, store seeds because apparently I didn't set it up for seeds. I got wheat. could swear I put seeds in here too, but apparently I didn't. So... Gonna need a storage for it too. Oh. Uh, pumpkin seeds. I don't know. 
Some of my pumpkins got stems got messed up over here, like right in here, or no, right here. And I'm not sure why. And right here. And right here and right here. So, oh, that's probably why, because you just walk right through my pumpkin patch like you own the place. Come on. Now you made me hit one of my pumpkins. Way to go. Thank you. Ah, oh, stupid. Uh, I'm gonna have to redo my pumpkin patch. <laughs> Not like it really matters. I don't need pumpkins all that greatly anyway. Ooh, I guess I better eat something here. Alright, good enough for now. Great, so put them in there even though they won't process through. They'll go over in the other bin, but that'll work for now. Anyway, I need to get out of here and go deal with real life stuff so I think that pretty much does it I'm gonna finish up this building I'll have to figure out how I wanna do I don't know I'm not big on buildings honestly I'm not but now we'll see figure out something build up a building around here so that way things ain't getting in there like it did in my pumpkins and set up some more storage set in my outputs here which I made the servos for well I made some oh uh, I got 15 of them and I have, uh, might have enough to actually do it uh, uh, lovely just throwing things around alright so yeah what I need to do is just have this set up to output. Um, I don't know where to. I'll put it maybe here. That way I can just grab it and throw it over here. I don't know, but it's becoming nighttime, and that is not good. I leave doors open again. All right, I'll close that one. Close that one. Alright, so go back into normal mode. Alright. Well, I guess we'll end it where we started it. So, yeah. Started here, we'll end here. So, like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And, you know, if you have comments, go ahead. Tell me what you like, don't like, whether this whole series is crap. Or whatever. And yeah, so have a good day. And I'm Blake Clavin, and I am out of here.